We've probably done enough damage. Never. Good morning. Good morning. You want a hand with that? Oh, thank you. I yeah. just need to put those. Thank you. No problem. Daddy. All right. All right. There we go. I don't want to do a pit. Ah, you're on uh, the Cincinnati picker? Yeah, that's right. Hi. Yeah. <laughs> I recognized you. Already. Small world. Dad, what's the hat? Dad, what did I have? Let's look around for a little bit first, buddy. But what's the hat? Are going to the helicopter? Probably. Dad, is it going to you go in the Oh, that's not the I'm gonna buy your cooler. All right. Um, do you mind if I start a pile? Sure. Um, wherever you want, maybe over there. Yeah, that'd be great. Thank you. We just need to make sure that people keep their hands off of it. I'll have to watch. I'll start finding more and filling it up. All right. Five hundred. Oh, but you can do that. It says five to seven. Man, you're fine. You're fine. Daddy says Did you find any that were a hundred or less? No. This one is five hundred. This one is seven hundred and fifty. This one is seven hundred and fifty pieces. Oh, that's cool. It's a Schwinn what is bell. That? That's a bell for a bike. Bell for a bike? Yeah. Do I like this? Maybe. Interested in this? Ooh, yeah, the ice crusher? Sure, yeah. How much are you asking for the uh, bundled up lots of magazines? Uh, they're free. Are they really? Yeah. Okay, great. I'll have to grab some of those before we go. Thank you. Oh, how cool is that? <laughs> Thank you. I'll buy that. Can I have that? Look, it's I salt and pepper shakers. Is that mine? She's shopping for me. Can I have this? Here, let's put it with our stuff, buddy. Can Look, can let's... I have that? Sure, buddy. Let's put it with our stuff. I, I'm going to have Oh, that. you want to pick that? Penguins. Sawyer. Hey. Where, where, where did this come from? In here? We gotta pick all this up. Come on. We don't make messes. No, I didn't do that. You didn't make a mess? No. Oh, well, let's just go ahead and pick it up anyways. Wait. Get the last two pieces. He said 20. 20 on the bin of bike parts? Yeah. Okay, and then... What do you need for the uh, VHS stuff? And then um, I've got three other pieces. VHS, what is it? There's tapes, there's this like programmer thing, uh, okay. plush. I'll bring them down. Okay. Um, they gave me prices on this, but I was curious about the VHS, all this stuff, and then I've got um, plush thing, some of this in here. Right. These are the old I'm looking for the They're new. Durand Fabric. There's not a lot, okay. but it's over over here. Fabric. How much? She's wanting to the fabric. I'd probably give five bucks for the box. I'm sorry, what? Another twenty for all of us. Um, well, I'm paying 10 for this, so would it be, oh, okay. would it be 10 for that? Oh, so it'd be, no, it'd be 5 for that, so that would be 15. Would you make it even 40 for everything? Sure. Appreciate you working with me. Thank you so much. Yeah. We're motivated. Yeah. We're moving. <laughs> yeah, you got to get rid of it, right? Right. Good luck with the move. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning. How are y'all? Doing good. Oh, that's so cool. So I look, there's a puzzle. Oh my gosh, that's 500. Oh, oh my gosh, um, this is hilarious. <laughs> what they had in here? Oh, are those Disney glasses? Yeah. Ooh, so there's Elsa. Oh yeah, three bucks. Yeah, I'll take it. I'm a sucker for anything red. Well, Cincinnati. Two chairs over here too. Cincinnati. Oh, yeah. Red. Cincinnati red. You can make a 
make a pile right there. I'm the pile watcher. You're the pile watcher? Right That's now. your official title? I'm taking a break. <laughs> Daddy, oh, can I finish the wedge gaming? Oh my yeah. god. Yeah. A dinosaur! Is that what you want to get, Sawyer? Yeah, I guess I'll take these two. Okay. Alright, I think we should probably pay. We've probably done enough damage. Never. <laughs> I've got plenty more stuff that you need to go more and more around. Yeah. The chairs it's are sweet. 15. So, so makes it 20, 23, 25, and that's three. It's $28 we owe you. Oh no, that's what you do. <laughs> this is my walking chair. Alright, let me go. Thank you. Back and get this inside. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank Good you. luck with your Thank sale. You. Thank you. Good morning. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I have three, but they're all in college now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we have this one. Oh, yeah. How much are you asking for the... Uh... Ooh, I, I, oh, I was just looking at them online. T 25. 25 bucks? Yeah, and you know no, what? They're like it. 140 Dad, we don't have it. Is it just Brewers or is it other teams too? No, you can open it. It's all, it's, it's the league. What's the league? Oh, National League. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, we don't have this. Yes, we do. No, we don't. Would you do 20 for it? Yeah. Okay, I'll take Absolutely. it. I'll keep looking around and see what yeah. else I can find. Somebody work for Rubbermaid? Yeah, I used to. Did you? Yeah. I was going to say I saw a lot of Rubbermaid stuff. Yeah. Is this a cooler? It's actually, it's like a hot or, or you can put hot stuff or cold stuff. Interesting. Yeah. Is this a rabbit? Looks like it. Hey, you see. Okay. <laughs> what were you going to ask me? I don't think so. Mm. She you wants to know how much that is. <laughs> you can have it. <gasps> what do you say? Free. Thank you. Thank You're you. welcome. So these are like a, I used to work for them too. But oh, did you? Yeah. Um, these are a high end, like. $19 mechanical pencils. They're mechanical pencils. They were their favorite. I remember you would supply the kids with those. I have a new book. The cat in the hat? Yeah. I know. I have some of those from my grandmother's house that I cannot get rid of. I have them. Is that a xylophone? It is the bell set. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. cool. They could say it's a $10. Like you can put buses and pens in it. Oh, yeah? I'm scared to show this to them because they're going to wake up your whole neighborhood. What? Nothing. Don't worry about it. No more squash sales. Oh my gosh. I have sold Avery's violin. I sold Cameron's snare drum. So I sold that's the last of the kids' middle school. Do you want have those? The new one? Who played this? Hey, can I try? So watch this. Yeah. I'll take this too. Okay, perfect. Um, okay. They won't let me leave without it now. No, that's awesome. All right. So I think I'm probably good. For me. Plus 20 would be 40. I was going to say, I definitely owe you more than 29. Well, yeah, you four. owe her 20. Gotcha. There's that. Thank you. And then 29 for 29 you. 29 for me. You have a single by chance? I sure do. Well, thanks for coming. We appreciate yeah, thank it. you so very much. I'm so glad that they're going to. Um, do you need some I'll go, go crazy with it. carry that belt, use that belt set. That's amazing. Good luck with the sale. Oh, thank you. You know what? I think I got it. Do you got it? Yeah, thank you, though. And then, how about... Yeah. They were in a box over here. Is this your sale? Yes, it is. Would you go 40 on that? Sure. Okay, thanks. Thank you. Thank you, man. I'm done hitting sales for the day, and I got some amazing stuff today. I'll start with this uh, stapler here. This is the Swingline Speed Pro 45. 45 because it has a 45-sheet uh, capacity. This is a heavy-duty stapler. Um, paid 10 for this, so they were selling for like 40 to 50 because it is new in the box. At that same sale, I got I think like 17 or 18 of these uh, Uniball Kuru Toga mechanical pencils i was having a hard time finding the exact one uh, but i saw very similar ones i want to say right around like 10 bucks a pop they had like some other like higher end ones that were going for a lot more money and i don't think it was the same one but i'll do some more research i'm pretty happy to get all those for a buck a piece um also at that sale i got this bedding set this is uh 
MLB Pottery Barn for kids. And she said it's got all the teams. You can see the Cubs there, the Giants there. Um, it's got the Shams with it. And this is a queen size. I paid 20 I saw these going from anywhere around like 70 to 100 bucks. So I was thrilled to find that. This was a really cool find. Um, this is a pearl. I called it um, a xylophone. But it's actually called uh, the keys or like the key set. And uh, kids are having fun playing with this thing. So I might just keep it for a little while and let them play with it until um, they either <laughs> lose interest or move on to something else. Uh, but this was only 10 bucks. Knew these things are going between like two and three hundred dollars. So I think a hundred bucks is a pretty realistic um, price that I'll probably sell that for. Got a couple folding chairs, uh, lawn chairs, Cincinnati Reds. Those are only seven fifty each. Those I'm definitely keeping. Um, let's move this stapler real quick and get in this cooler i got the cooler and everything else at that sale for 40 i've got about 10 bucks into the cooler um it's a red coleman the bottom looked really good always check the bottoms of these when you buy them because sometimes they just get deteriorated and really gross um sawyer wanted this <laughs> i don't know what i paid for this yeah that's that's <laughs> sawyer's let's see let me move this over um the lady there was really cool she recognized me um from the YouTube channel, and she was like doing shopping for me while I was there, which was really nice. This is a uh, vintage ice crusher. This I thought was super cool. It might not have value, but it's a, uh, I guess it's just like a desktop display. Oh, is it a coin bank? Oh, it's a coin bank. You put coins in there and then you open it through the bottom. That's pretty neat. And then this right here was by far the best find of the day. When I saw it, I had no idea if it was worth anything. I was just like, this is cool. It's a vintage um, bike bell. And to be honest with you, most vintage bike parts are not worth a lot of money. I found a bunch of this stuff over the years that I buy and then I go look up and it turns out it's kind of worthless. This thing is essentially new old stock. So we've got all the packaging and everything. I think it's got a couple scuffs and scratches. So I'll probably sell it as used, especially since the box has a tear. But I saw a couple of these sell between $100 and $150. And they are pretty rare. I think only one or two was sold in the last 90 days. And there's no active ones uh, with the original box. So I was really happy to look that up when I got back. Let's see what else we got. This is a big bin of bike parts. Um, this right here has a little bit of value. This is a Shimano uh, Titleist GS oh, derailleur. Somebody that knows bike parts will comment below and let me know what this is. Um, I think it's a derailleur. I think these are like the brakes. Obviously, these are the gears. I don't know that there's a lot of value here. This, I think, was going for about 20 Got this big box of uh, sealed blank VHS tapes. Let's see. There are about 14 of them in there. That's, I don't know, maybe 20 bucks worth. Uh, this is a VCR Plus Instant Programmer. It has no value whatsoever, but I love old, goofy stuff like this. It just doesn't really have any use anymore. I just kind of think it's cool. Um, so, yeah, I'd hate leaving stuff like this behind. If anybody's watching this and wants this for their collection or whatever reason, let me know. Shoot me an email. I'll send it to you. Uh, my email is down below in the description. Got this Frosty the Snowman. This is by the Jimmy Company, G-E-M-M-Y. Didn't even notice that when I bought it. I just thought it was three bucks. It's a singing snowman. I'll absolutely buy the singing stuff that cheap all day long. This was an excellent find. Uh, this is the Dymo Twin Turbo. Uh, it does not print the four by six labels. It prints, you know, the smaller ones. You can kind of see the rolls here. Got that for 40 and it's going between like 150 and 200. Last, but certainly not least, uh, one sale had some Cincinnati red stuff. Uh, there was like a flag and um, some tattoos and some other things, and the kids have already snatched all that stuff out of there. And I guess just like a random red bowl. Got that whole thing for three bucks. You guys probably noticed I am not at my shop. So the lease ran up on the shop, and I decided not to renew it just because I, was, I had so much space there that I wasn't using. I had been doing some sales there that hadn't been doing that great. And I had just accumulated so much stuff and I really couldn't justify paying that rent anymore. So I have a storage unit now that I'm working out of and obviously working out of the house as well. So wanted to let you know, not in the shop anymore, but I'll definitely keep making videos. That is it for this video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.